Kauai police are warning folks to watch out for a computer virus that could target your bank account. Spam from what appears to be the Social Security Administration is being sent out, prompting users to type in their personal information and download a statement which infects the computer with a virus that gains access to bank accounts. And that is also a reminder that while this is the season for giving, the holidays are also the season for scams. There are plenty of Grinches out there looking to take your money. KITV 4's Paul Drew shows us what you can do to protect yourself if you want to donate to charity this Christmas. It's a story that's new at 6. The sounds of the holiday season include the sounds of giving. It makes me feel really good inside. I think you should always give from the heart. I think it's really important that everybody shares, especially during the holidays. But while many legitimate organizations would like your money now, so would scammers. This is prime time for the con artists. People are of good cheer, they're giving to charities, um, they're in a rush, they're looking for bargains, and all of these conditions just are right for a situation where the consumer will be ripped off. Over the holidays, there is a spike in scams as crooks try to cash in on your generosity. While you could lose some money from scammers on the street, you could lose much more from scammers targeting you on the Internet. There are fake websites that look like real charities looking not just to get a donation, but access to your money. The real danger is if they have all your information. If you give them your credit card numbers, if you give them personal information, passcodes, etc., um, that really makes it very difficult for you for identity theft later. Oh, thank you. So before you give, do a little research. Ask about the organization and where the money goes. If you're contacted by someone representing a charity, look up its number in the phone book and call back before you make your donation. A legitimate organization won't call you and say, give me all this information. They're not going to ask you for your bank account number. They're not going to ask you for your credit card number. And look out for friends and family this holiday season. You may not fall for a charity scam, but others will. My mom used to get a whole lot of things in the mail, and we'd always have to watch out for her. So you just have to be aware. And that was Paul Drews reporting. If you have any doubts about the person or organization asking you for money, do not give them any cash, credit card, or bank account details at all. Now, for more tips for giving to charity, head to our website, KITV.com.